Hello everyone, it's me Jebby from Unique Tutorials. Today in this video I will show you how to get floating universal search bar in any Windows computer. So without further more delay, let's begin. So firstly what you need to do is just open any web browser and in the Google search you need to choose the application name as Uli Power Launcher. Just search this application in the Google search and you will see on the first list its official website. So just click on it. So now you can see its official website. So here is a preview about how the application looks like. So you can see on the upper right side, download, just click on it. Now you will be provided uh, two types of installer for different operating systems. So if you're using a Windows, then you can just select the Windows installer. And if you're using a Mac operating system, then you can choose the Mac version installer. So here I'm using a Windows computer, so I'll be just selecting the Windows installer. So you can download a either exe or you can download a portable version which does not need to get installed. So I'll just download the installer which I'm going to install. So click on it. So just save the file or to download. Wait for a few seconds. So finally the application has been downloaded so let me go to the folder where it is being downloaded and let me close the web browser. So you can see now the installation file. So you need to double left click it to run the software installer. Just click on install. Wait for a few more seconds until the complete installation is done. So finally the software has been installed successfully so you can just click on finish. So now it will appear on the desktop home screen as you can see here on the desktop home screen right. So you can see here Yuli and even it has been started already so you can see on the tray that is the menu tray as you can see here on the right bottom just right click on it. And now you can see your settings, right? Just click on settings to see what are the options that is provided. So you can see here on the first option, you will be given options for appearance. You can just sense the appearance of the size of that church bar. You can change the fonts, you can change the color themes, and in general, you can make it run whenever the windows gets put up. And even you can just minimize it to the tray icons. And here are the shortcuts how to enable this floating universal search bar. So you can see here by default you need to press Alt and Space. So let us press Alt and Space in our computer keyboard to make it open. So you can see a floating search bar appears on the upper side of the computer screen. So you can just customize depending upon your needs, whichever button combinations you like to set by yourself. So I will just keep it as by default and below you will see a tons more options to customize by yourself depending upon what settings you like to set for this charge bar. So here you can see the fourth option is a charge engine. So you can do some settings here also. You can just build blacklist some folder files or also here if you wish and below you will see your plugins right like application charts browser bookmarks calculators color converters a tons of options so I'll not make you bored by discussing each and every options so I'll directly jump to one options which is really needed so you 
can see here simple folder chairs right so by default it will just enable your user account folder so if you have a folder like so let me show you by going to this PC so I have a two folders C drive and D drive so by default it's only selected the that is my user folder right so what I will do I will try to add the enter C drive and the D drive here so that whenever I search anything then it will try to find in the enter computer hard disk so for this what you need to do just click on here add folder and you can see here a folder so select it now it will lock it to the folders now you can select the enter drive just select this D drive and select folder now click on set wait for a few seconds finally the D drive enter D drive is added so we don't need this first option just will delete or you can just edit it also so let me edit it here so I'll just go to the folder and I'll select the enter C drive and select folder click on set wait for a few seconds so finally the enter C drive and the D drive has been added successfully on this applications so now whenever you search anything say press old and space to enable the floating universal search bar so if you want to search any folder files text documents videos music whatever you like even the website links also you can search using this universal search bar so let me search one folder like pc walls so you can see here in my d drive is really present a uh, folder name as pc walls so let me show you by going to the d drive so you can see here folder name as PC world so if you select the enter C or D drive or whatever drives you have then it will search everything every file that is like documents videos files text or whether a software files or anything related that is present inside your local hard disk so this might be very useful if you want to find out everything just using a simple search then you should definitely try this cool applications and the good thing is that it's far better than the normal inbuilt windows search bar which does not search everything that is present inside the windows computer so using this floating universal search bar in your windows computer you can search everything very easily right on your computer desktop so if you find this video tutorial useful click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching